Assalamualaikum guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Umdadi and you are watching Amadi Boss. So guys, today I am going to tell you about nouns. Nouns, uh, you would be thinking that nouns are so easy that I don't even need to listen to them. I already know about them. But today I am going to tell you about different types of nouns. So firstly, what is a noun? A noun is a... Um, is a name that describes a place, a person, uh, a thing, of an, uh, and an idea or a feeling. I am going to use the, the, all of these in a sentence. For example, I will give example first for the, these names. For person, it is Samantha. For place, it can be Lahore. For uh, um, for any object, it can be a book or a bus, and for any idea, it can be freedom, and for any feeling, it could be happiness. So, I will use them in these sentences. Uh, Samantha went to Lahore on a bus. She was very happy, and she understood the concept of freedom over there. I have used these uh, words in a sentence and as you see I have just made the sentence up. So this uh, you can also do this by understanding noun perfectly. Now after we have done with noun let's get to singular and plural nouns. Singular noun is a noun that is a singular noun is a noun that is only that is single in quantity. There is only one in quantity, but um, for example, chair or a table, uh, and I will give you an example as a sentence. I sat on the chair, I dragged the table, I played with my bat. Then we have uh, plural nouns. Plural noun. What are plural nouns? Not plural. Plural nouns. Plural nouns are the nouns that are more than one in quantity. For example, chairs, tables, beds, balls, mirrors, uh, tables, uh, doors, doors, and then we also have curtains, windows, trophies, bags, we also have medals, um, and etc. So, <clears throat> let's uh, get uh, into making the sentence. I get I bring my bed beds to, uh, to I bring my beds to play with my friends to uh, and my friend uh, friends brought wickets and balls to play so I've used most of uh, plural words as you can see beds balls wickets and friends these are plural plural verbs nouns plural nouns so like this, you can make the singular and plural noun sentences. Now, I will tell you about the rest of the nouns in the next video. Till then, if you want to uh, speak fluent English, you can watch my video in my uh, channel. From my channel, you can speak uh, English fluently under one month. And there would be only four, five to six steps you have to do in one month. But you have to be fast and you have to maintain a good pace. So guys, till then, you can watch that video and uh, I will tell you about the next video. Till then, um, uh, till then watch any other video. Till the next one, Allah Hafiz.